business. We opened up in February of 2020, and it was going quite well. Um, but then, obviously, big C hit, and then you know the world just sort of went on like standstill. We had to close, like most businesses did, but uh, we just hired a couple of new people. Uh, we obviously wanted to pay them, so we were thinking, how can we get around this? It sucked, to be honest, because not only was it people's uh, business, but it's also, you know, furlough was never a thing, it's never been a thing before. I want to make sure that staff members could basically get paid and they could pay their rent and they could live. So it's a lot of stress, a lot of pressure. We, we never went completely in the red, but there was definitely times where it was scary, scary. Um, like there's been a couple of times where we've had, yeah, like 20 pounds in the bank account. So we were thinking, how can we get around this? Like. How we pay people, how we support people, do what we do. Um, so we did take away for a uh, couple months, and originally uh, we set out with a goal of making this amount of money by the end of the week, so we could pay all our staff. We made that amount of money in the first day. We sold out in four hours, and then just built, and built, and built, and built from there. basically roll the dice and see, oh, hopefully this, this will work, this is going to work. And thankfully it has, because we're still here. And now, and now we have about 20 pounds. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Company's it's flipped, doing great. It's flipped. Us, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>Friends, lot, lots of people that were just didn't want to really stay at home, they wanted to meet and mingle with other people, people like desperate for any form of human interaction. Um, so they came to us, they came to us <laughs> the worst type of human interaction. Um, but the street opposite was actually filled with people, um, and it was, yeah, it was a nice time. It used to be a cute little Good bar one. upstairs, yeah, that's always been the tagline. Right. It's supposed to be only four members of staff, now we're on 30 members of yeah. staff. You're out of control. So the landlord basically said, oh, you've done really well at takeaway, you've done well upstairs, do you want to have a crack downstairs? And for some reason we thought, well, we've come this far, so we might as well just go down a bit further. But we can go deeper. <laughs> Yeah, it seems to resonate with people. We call ourselves inauthentic Mexico. So we take all the traditional cooking methods, but then we can just spruce it up a bit. We've done baby squid, we've done pigeon, we've done uh, goat. If it once lived, it's, it's it, been it, a it, taco, it, and it's great. Everyone wins, except for me. <laughs> except for you. <laughs> There's nothing really else like this in Cardiff, and it's that whole thing about because it's unauthentic, there's no kind of pretentiousness as you come in, it's a little bit weird. The service is a little bit weird, everything's a little bit fun and loose. We are the best bad decision you will make today. You see everyone was really stressed out, no one knew what the next week was gonna look like, let alone the next day. It was, yeah, just a real nice sense of community. Everyone sort of would forget a lot of stresses and worries, like at home and come here and have a good time. Um, <laughs> it would be kind of like a safe place for people as well.
like you get a lot of friends or hospitality or like just regulars you've been before that would just come here after a shit day and just like have a laugh and a nice drink and it was kind of like it still is kind of like a nice little community of just people who have had a shit day. It was it was a lot of fun working with friends, I think. Like um, <laughs> We was, don't remember half. Well we don't remember half of it. Yeah, no, liquid breakfast. We had champagne on our golden grahams. It was phenomenal. <laughs> it was the best of times, it was the worst of times. Maybe we should end on a shot? Yeah, we'll end on a shot. There we go. Yeah. Yeah.